is going on ladies and gentlemen your boy hunter x here bringing us another episode of project ozone 3 cap mode no emc hope you're all having a fantastic day with that being said if you're new around here click that subscribe button and let's get into today's episode Alrighty, guys so i think i want to kind of start off today's episode or today's episode is going to be about making a mob farm now we need a mob farm so i think here's what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and go and, can we get stone ladders are stone ladders a thing in this pack they are good 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 goody good good so i guess i can just do this right yes perfect so we can go ahead and make a bunch of these and then we need you know what i should have probably yeah okay i was about to say <laughs> there better be so we need about two stacks of blocks uh to get started right so we're gonna go ahead and head on over to the mining dimension where we're gonna go ahead and or not mining dimension sorry the um hold on my keyboard keeps losing power for some reason and i don't know why can can you work please all right cool so we we're gonna go ahead and basically build up all the way up oh you know what i didn't bring i didn't bring a crafting table that's fine that's fine let, let me build up to the uh 128 blocks and we shall be back There's only one way down from here. Which is killing myself. How nice. That's that's always beautiful, right? Okay, let's actually go ahead and do slash set home. So that way I can actually just set home. Instead of having to kill myself. Uh oh, you know what? Hold on. While I'm here, let me grab a crafting table and some other stuff and i will meet you guys back when we're at the mob farm Alrighty, guys so we're actually gonna go ahead and build on the bottom half that's not where i wanted you to go can i still get that not really it's not worth it don't do it all right we're gonna go ahead and build out just like this we're gonna go ahead and expand our horizons so basically, we're going to build a nice, beautiful platform at the top of this uh, little uh, thingy here. Two, three, four. Now, I'm deciding whether if I want to do a drop farm. One, two, three, four. I haven't decided whether if I want to do a drop farm or a actually maybe a drop farm might be best. One, two, three, four. Maybe a drop farm is kind of like the best solution. But I'm not really sure. Uh to be honest with you. I mean they they do work. But I'm not sure if that's something that we want to work on or if that's something that we want. Or like what the deal is. What the deal y'all is specifically. But. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying to think, do we have access to. Vector plates. Um, or anything, because I know that we don't have access to slime, I think it is, because we're so high up in the overworld. I'm not really too sure. Uh, yeah, we don't have, we, we can't get to Batania yet, and the only way to get slime balls is through cheese curds, which you can't even get. 
because you need cheese ore for that. Ooh, jellyfish, actually. Jellyfish do have. But you need slime for that. It's a tier two seed. And we don't have, we're not even there yet. Uh, magma cream. Seem like a really good option. And we can get some magma cream. From. Molten cores. Which we can get from loot bags, which I think we've gotten a few already of those um, molten core things, but I'm not really sure. Um, yeah, I'm not really too sure. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. I got to expand this out. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, no. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. So that's perfect. Um, let's go back to the base and let's see what we have ready available to us. Um, I'm not really sure what we have available to us right now uh at our disposal if you will um i don't think you can get villagers uh you know what a good point would be let's look at vector plates um so it looks like slime balls are kind of like oh nope adhesive adhesive i mean coagulated blood Adhesive coagulated blood we can get. Blood is not that uh, hard to get. Like if I jump into the smeltery, I'm able to get blood. But we're gonna need a lot of vector plates, and I mean a lot of vector plates, because each hole is nine by nine. So. That's 81 per side. There's four sides. We would need. Time to whip out. Time to do the math. Uh, so 81 times four, 324. And we get how many vector plates? Uh, we get eight. So it's about 40. 0.5 times 160 millibuckets per. So we need 41. Well, let's say we need 41. And each is 160 millibuckets. So we need about six and a half buckets. And rotten flesh gives 40. Gives 40. So I need to do, I need 164 rotten flesh, which is roughly two and a half stacks of rotten flesh. That is a lot of zombie flesh that I don't think I have, uh, like anywhere. Like we, like we would need to go, we would literally need to go hunting in the hunting dimension to get that much blood uh that much rotten flesh i should say uh do we want to go that route hmm yeah let me go explore the nether a little bit see if i can find any of those magma slimes um just because i don't think there's really any way to get a slime sapling besides like going to the nether right because I don't, I don't think I have access uh to get that that's not through uh abyssal craft so give me a moment all right guys I said fuck it and we're just gonna we're, I'm literally, I'm literally gonna go watch some uh some reddit videos while I um 
go hunting. So yeah, I'm gonna go go ahead and hunt three stacks of freaking rotten flesh or hunt zombies and uh get myself some rotten flesh so we shall be back as soon as i'm done um hunting Alrighty, guys so we actually got went ahead and got seven buckets of blood here so what i need to go ahead and do is i need to pour a bunch of this actually you know what? i don't have to hold on i don't think obsidian's gonna pour right obsidian won't pour yeah i didn't think so so what we can do is we can go ahead and automate this a little bit I can turn this back on and that that should automate the the blood that we need for that so let's go ahead and let me grab what do we want do we want i think we want stone brick right okay so we don't have a lot of stone so let me here while we're waiting for that i oh no that's gravel never mind i was gonna say let me uh go grab some more stone here do we have okay we got sharpening kits on us so that we're pretty much good there uh can i put not really uh we can just go ahead and avoid that i guess we don't need it we can go ahead and get rid of that as well i'm gonna go ahead and get some more stone and i shall be back Alrighty, guys i went ahead and got a shit ton of a crap a poop ton of stone all right a poop ton all right, let's go ahead and get rid of a lot of this stuff. We don't need any of this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Our slime balls should be done. Actually, you know what's funny enough? We we went we uh did that, and we needed stone, or we actually needed that uh for the vector plates, right? The vector plates. Uh, you. Okay, so we need two iron. Ooh, sugar. How are we gonna deal with sugar? Sugar, 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 sugar. Um, you know what? Sugar cane can be gotten or put into the bonsai trees. Okay, so that gives us a reason to use bonsai trees, right? Yeah, so I'm thinking, do we have sugar cane? Is that something that we have available to us? Oh, sugar cane can that be wait, sugar cane seeds. We can get sugar cane seeds somehow by yes sifting dirt in the string meshes right uh here let's go take a nap all righty guys so i got i got us uh, some sugarcane seeds i want to test this out to see if this actually works so we're going to go ahead and go over here to this pond i should be able to get a sugarcane out of this yes beautiful by the way this is running beautifully over here. I think we're out of coal. Yes, we are fully out of coal. And we are pretty close to darn full. Well, this, th these are full here. So yeah, we're, we're probably gonna need to upgrade those at some point or another uh, down the road. Uh, so I wanna grab a chest really quickly um boop. and i'll put it here for now i guess and our hopping bonsai is right here and i think it said it needed some sand is what it needed and doop. i want to see if you can do it you can't do it with sugarcane seeds but i think you can do it with sugarcane you can do it with sugarcane oh but that's really slow i guess Hmm. Okay. So I guess what I'm going to do over here then is I'm going to pop those two years of getting down and let them grow. And we're probably at some point going to make an industrial size sugar farm, right? Do we have observers? We do. Okay. So observers is 112. Okay, so then that means we can do the infinitely expanding uh, sugarcane farm, right? Uh, yes, so we're gonna need a lot of sugar. And I mean a lot of sugar. Hmm. I guess. 
we can infinitely expand that, right? That's like infinitely expandable. Where is all my? There they are. It only really needs iron. A little bit of iron and some. Nope, don't do that. Whoops. All right, take that out. And that should give me some more iron. And then some chests, which we have over here somewhere. Do, 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 do. Where are my chests? I guess, yeah, we can do something like this. Upper. You. Popping bonsai. And we can go ahead, I guess, and place these down. Like this. I mean, it's not gonna, it's gonna not go that fast, but yeah, I wish there was an easier way to like quickly grow sugarcane. Unless there's like an easy way. Actually, there technically is. Hold on. Uh. You see this rock candy stuff? This raw rock candy. If we piece it together, we can get hardened rock candy. And then hardened rock candy could then be converted into sugar. Right? So that's one way of getting sugar. And we only need roughly like what? I forgot how many vector plates we needed. We need quite a bit of rect vector plates though. All right, and I'm also gonna need quite a bit of iron. So let's just get that started. And I think for vector plates, it's also going to be two stone, two iron, and then some sort of slime ball, but we've already got the slime ball covered. So we need 44 pieces of sugar. And then that's gonna be 88 pieces of iron, which is, uh, I'm gonna say roughly a stack and a half of iron. So, and then that's two stacks of stone. And then we should have quite a bit of this. We only need 44. So that's good. So there's eight there. That's 46. Perfect. We might need a little bit more. But uh, we shall see. I don't know. Maybe we might. It depends on how we build the setup. So there we go. We're gonna grab four sets of those. Do that. And then another four sets of these. All right, so that's that's a lot of stone brick to build with. Beautiful. Let's go, let's go walking on our beautiful path. Uh game. Thank you. It's like game, don't start. <laughs> game, don't you dare. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and before we go in there though, let me just I need to move my my recording software to my other monitor. Alright, let's go. In we go. And up the platform we go. Up the platform we go. God, I wish you can go up these platforms faster. I'll meet you guys up there. All right, guys. So I'm thinking we're going to go this way because I want to be right in this. Like, I want to be here. So this is going to be our farm. Right. All right. So we want our walls to go. Here, right? Wait, where's the three by three platform in the center? All right, so this needs to come over one. Uh, and then Push this back to 
Is that correct? That should be correct. So, wall here, wall there. Wall there. Right? So, one, two, three, here. Like that. And then I can I can basically get this out of here. Make sure it's not connected in any shape, way, or form. Stay in my that. Okay. So we're gonna want so that's one full box space. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so wait, this is I know exactly. So this was 20. So that's this is 21. 22. I think it's 23 that they have to fault and die. I think. We'll find out if I die here. Oh, perfect. That's the that's the perfect height. Okay, um, yeah. Is there an easier way I can do this? You know what I could do? Uh, slash set warp. The, or mob farm. One. All right, let me, let me build this up and we will be right back. Alrighty guys. So now what we need to do is one, two three so one two three four five six seven eight two three four five six seven eight so now i gotta do this on all three sides three four five six seven eight that doesn't seem right. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Why? Oh, it's because it's not centered properly. That's why. One two three four five six seven eight mm, two three four five six seven eight and these are going to be our spawning platforms here two three four five six seven eight two three four one two three four five six seven wait i'm confused one two three four five six seven eight okay then you do this Yeah, we're gonna run out of stone. Building this. All right, so that's this is gonna be platform one. Just because I know I don't have the resources. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh. Yeah, we're definitely gonna run out of resources. So I'm gonna go ahead and go back home real quick and grab some more resources and we will be right back. Honestly, guys, I'm really hoping that this mob farm works. Oh man, that would be bad if it didn't work. All right, let's get up here. All right, what I'm gonna do is I don't mind my deaths. I kind of fell to my death. 
which was kind of like an oops. Alright, yeah, let's, let's climb up. I know I'm wasting resources, but you know, it's fine. And then, mm, are we? I can't tell if we're actually dragging. All right, so that's section one of the mob farm done. Yeah, you definitely don't want to fall off of this. You'll definitely die if you fall off of this. That's a fact. <laughs> that is a fact, my friend. If you fall off of this at this height, you will die. That's no doubt it. No doubt about it. We're like what 150 something blocks in the sky. Oh yeah, we're, we're pretty freaking high. We are pretty high in the sky. I'm not sure if we have enough to do the entire thing. I might I might come back up and do like cobblestone, for example, for the roof. Because, yeah, stone brick is... I mean, it's not expensive, because I can just go mine with my silk touch hammer, but... You know. And then, like, all this for what? If the farm doesn't work? <laughs> I'll be very upset. I will be one upset boy. To be H. Alright, now what we're going to do is we're going to basically come around... And do a ring around the entire uh, mob farm. I don't trust myself to not go with shift. So, yeah. So, yeah, this is going to be the mob farm now. This is the where the mob farm walls are going to come in. And we're going to be able to, 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 you know, do the thing. Uh, put the walls up and stuff and make it look all pretty do all the pretty stuff all right i think we have like what one more side yeah How about one more side it's not gonna have enough there's no way there's no way this is gonna be enough to do Four, at least four layers deep. That's what she said. I'm four layers deep in him. Oh, he's four layers deep in me. Oh, yeah, there's no way. We're gonna have to go m even more stone harvesting. No way. There's no way. Right, that's layer one. Layer two. Yeah, we're out already. We're out already. Alrighty, guys. So we went ahead and got some more stone. I'm going to go ahead and grab... What is it? 512 is four stacks? Yeah. We're going to go ahead and grab more of this stone brick stuff because we're going to need it. Uh, let's go back to our mob farm. I say mob farm one because we're going to be building multiple mob farms. But yeah, for now, we should be good. We should be all set up now. And now, oh, I didn't bring the vector plates. Oh, boy. Gotta go back. <laughs> Gotta go back. Alrighty, guys. So we got the vector plates. Uh, okay. Oh, you know what I didn't bring? I didn't bring a crafting table. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. We're gonna go ahead. I'll come back up and do the uh the things. So what we're gonna what we're gonna want to do is basically. Uh, 
cover this entire area with these vector plates, right? And these vector plates are going to push the mobs right into the, uh, the lovely little channel. And that little channel is going to push them right down to us, the player, where we're going to go ahead and absolutely slay their face. Right? So when they drop down this, uh, magnif mag this magnificent drop, they're going to be, uh... At about half a heart, which is uh, pretty bog. And then we'll go ahead and do this. I mean, these vector plates are pretty slow. Uh, yeah, we've got quite a bit of vector plates still. I'm hoping we have enough because I didn't account for doing the the, uh, the walkways as well. But that should be that should be fine um if anything we can get more blood and uh and stuff and yeah we only have about a stack and a half which is probably not gonna be enough so we are gonna have to come back here anyway and we're gonna have to you know do what we do what we gotta do all right that, le that leaves us with 32 vector plates. Yikes. Yikes. That's the yikes. Great. Now I gotta climb all the way back up. Uh. Yeah, let me, uh. Let me, let me go, uh, make some, some things and, uh. We'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. So here comes the sketchy part, right? We gotta take all these down. I still don't think I don't have enough vector plates. I think what we can do actually to prevent spawns from happening. I don't really have enough torches on me. prevent too many spawns but just to keep things from spawning why I try to finish this I wouldn't mind having a few torches down just for my safety to be fair That was 14 per side. I think. Is what that was. Uh, yeah, we're going to be a little shy. I think. That's not what I wanted. Yeah, I think we're gonna be a little shy. No, we still have a whole stack of vector. Where the hell did that stack of vector points come from? Oh, this is gonna be sketch. <laughs> no, we're good. Yeah, we're 100% good. All right, before I, before I do this though, I need, I do need to come up here. And I do need to finish this first. So, let me let me finish this and we'll be right back. All righty, guys. This is going to get sketchy really quickly. Um, I almost want to put up my game in peaceful mode just because like, I still gotta, I gotta crawl all the way down and get out. I'm on the wrong side. I'm on the wrong side.
All right, nice. Now I'm hoping nothing comes down while I'm trying to come down. You know, like say, I don't know, a creeper. That would be really bad. All right, nice. Okay, good. Tell you some moment of truth, is this gonna work? That's a good question. Is this farm gonna work? Hmm. Let me see. Yeah, it's mostly in one chunk. Maybe chunk loading this. I don't think I have to stand 25 blocks away, right? I might. I can probably get away with Would this be I mean I guess we could lower this floor one. That could be an option. I'm not really seeing any mobs spawning here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 40. Okay, I'm 30 blocks away. I guess we're just gonna have to kind of see if this farm works or not I'm, I'm i'm gonna have to do some testing in between episodes but with that being said guys unfortunately it is time to wrap up today's episode as always guys if you guys did enjoy today's episode please do me a huge favor smash the like button smash the subscribe button ding down that notification bell become a part of the hunters tribe by joining by joining hit by joining the discord everything is linked down in the description down below as always guys i'm gonna love you i'm gonna leave you till next time